Hi Aries, welcome to your April 2017 love reading with Island Girl Tarot. I hope everybody's having a great April so far trying to. I know we've got uh, everything just about in the sky is gone uh, retrograde, uh, most of it in your sign. So I know that things must be feeling heavy depending on your natal chart, slow, way, very weighty, unexpected things happening. So, um, I would highly recommend, there's so many wonderful astrologers out there, make sure you find yourself a good one, get your natal birth chart done, and with that said, Aries, I'm going to get right to it. Oh, join me Saturdays, I'm going to change this time to 11.30 on Saturday mornings uh, for Tarot Time with Island Girl on Facebook, and you can email me, islandgirl2008 at gmail.com, that's islandgirl2008 at gmail.com. Hang on, I'm going to turn this a little bit more that way. There. Okay. Give you a little more. There we go. All right. Okay. Aries, 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 Aries. The bottom of the deck um, is the hanging man. And put over here in the light, I better get it better. It's the hanging man. I'm using the gilded tarot. That's typically a card of pause, thought, pers perspective. It can be uh, a spiritual meditation card as well. Let's see how it plays in. Um, <clears throat> Well, Aries, the center of your reading is the Six of Pentacles. Um, you know, I feel like, Aries, from what it looks like, um, that whatever is happening in your love life is going to be happening at work. Pardon my nose. I think we still have some pollen going on. I feel like uh, you may have left your last job. Okay, you may have uh, just didn't tell anybody and just simply walked away from it. Um, you know, Aries, it it's really, really hard to make this a love reading because um, it's just screaming you started a new business on your own. Um, you know, that can be something that you love. Maybe you've taken a hobby and turned it into something that you love. It can be the birth of a new business. Oops, I do have the Empress. That was the Knight of Pentacles that fell. I'm not going to pick him up, but we're going to remember him. Um, because he's definitely playing a big, big hand in this. We've got the Knight of Pentacles, the Page of Pentacles, the Six of Pentacles, and uh, the Empress. And to me, that's about... Either a student needing money, you know, this could love family relationships. It could be perhaps uh, your child is, you know, those college invitations are, are being sent out about right now. And that could very well be what this is. That she may have had a kid end up with some sort of offer, the Knight of Pentacles, uh, that they got through, you know, internet. Uh, or through the mail, what have you, is the Page of Pentacles um, to a school that you all had maybe not anticipated the level of uh, being able to afford. And the Knight of Pentacles could also represent, you know, a banker, someone helping you with the loan. Um, the Four of Swords, to me, is telling me you guys are going to need to meditate on this as well as the Moon. You're going to be able to pull it off, though. There is the Eight of Cups. I see this person being able to go and, um, and, and take this college or take this course or, you know, go to this university. I see them going off on their own. And with the Eight, you know, maybe what this is, maybe this is some sort of exchange program that maybe your child has been offered a... Uh, Excuse me, my nose is running. Um, maybe your child has been offered a chance to go to college in another country. 
and you guys may not be prepared for it and you're trying to anticipate and think of all the things that might they might need that might be going wrong and I also think maybe that's where the hangman comes in as far as a different perspective uh, because he's knowledge see when he and I sorry I can't remember uh, the name right off the top of my head but it was said the person hanging from the tree is the one that discovered the runes because he was looking at the rocks from a different angle right so I just feel like if you guys are have been blindsided by this for some reason and this is something that was unexpected um, but boy I know you're proud mama um, because you've got the moon and the empress I mean that just really means child and then you've got the page of, of pentacles as a student I really feel like this may be exactly what this is if and this is not going to resonate with everybody and so if it doesn't please just go check out your rising and your moon sign and again that's what your natal charts for um, but if it does by all means please let me know I'm, I'm very interested to hear about it because I really feel like this may be a situation where they're going to be traveling perhaps uh, overseas to a different country to go to college a student exchange program something but like I said I really feel like you guys are are going to be able to with the knight of pentacles he was incoming so let's not forget him I think he's gonna be the banker the uh, scholarship incoming that is gonna facilitate this so try and meditate and concentrate on any and all of your options that you have um, talk to everybody that you can think of uh, and try and go for as many different scholarships as you can because that's just how this is really reading out to me uh, today Aries I'm sorry it's not uh, love love in hearts and flowers but we do love our kids and sometimes they show up in love reading so I hope everybody has a great April I'll be dropping the finances uh, financials on uh, April the 15th I figured that would be appropriate again don't push send on the 15th wait and do it the 17th or I did mine the other day they're ready I'm not gonna file them until the 17th but so I hope everybody has a great a great April if you have any questions or comments by all means please leave me some feedback I enjoy interacting if you're interested in a reading I feel like I'm very reasonable I do ask for a 15 minute minimum just so we can be thorough and both of us gets a chance to talk uh, but I am very, very reasonable. So thank you so much, Aries, for your likes, shares, and subscribes. Take care. Fry Island Girl Tarot. Bye-bye.